Alright, sorry about that. Uh, Alright, sorry about that. There was a slight problem with the internet or something that messed up that video, so I wasn't able to finish it. So the video is going to be in two parts, actually. Um, I'm sorry about that. Um, so where I left off was I was going to show you something that is really painful for me to do. But I feel you have to see in order for this to really... For everyone to really get the understanding that's needed. Um, so here goes. Please, again, don't laugh. Alright, so. This is one of the garments I'm talking about that I have to wear every single day as you see it's made out of a compression type material and it holds a lot of it the skin in um, now I'm going to show you what I'm left with this is the extra skin that I have been left with after and as you can see it is all just flabby useless skin that I do not in any way shape or form need there is nothing about this skin that I actually need it serves no medical purpose whatsoever there is as you can see I actually have a small rash under there right now um, there's actually I mean could you imagine every day just having that and over here I mean seriously that is what my I'm left with up here, I mean, look at that. This is my life. This is what I am left with. Look at that. Look how horrible that is. I mean, think about that. These are some, they're really hard to see, but that of course stretches all the way around. There's these, I mean, look at that. All of that is just skin, excess skin that serves no human purpose but to impede my life. Then there's this on each arm. I mean, that is what I am left with after losing. Now, granted, I have been able to lose the apron that hung down to here, but all of this stays. I mean, look at it. That is what I deal with every day. I'm 270 pounds, and I probably have 40 pounds of skin that I don't need in any way, shape, or form. Could you imagine trying to, this is what happens when I try to exercise. Think about that. Think about that. Put yourself in my shoes and tell me it's cosmetic. I need your help. I want to get rid of this. I ask you to please help me. I'm doing all the work that I can. If anybody thinks that this journey is not painful for me, it is. I ask you to visit my GoFundMe page. Thomas Toll, GoFundMe. Gardner man loses 500 pounds. Donate. 
help me share this message get it out there spread the word get this nationwide and help me reach my goal so I can go to Central Maine Medical Center here in Maine and get my surgery done at Central Maine Plastic Surgery within the next couple of months so that I can enjoy summer 2015 feeling like a man and not like I'm an alien. Thank you all for your help. God bless you. And thank you for taking the time to watch this video. And please don't forget me.